Hey, good morning. This is Osamu Wakabayashi from Zen Ideas. Today, I want to, uh, today's uh, quick tutorial is um, I want to talk about how you can add new website on your Google Analytics. Now, some of my clients have uh, not only just one website, so they have uh, multiple micro website, and it is important to uh, keep track the web uh, traffic and to keep analyzing who's visiting and how many people are visiting uh, and so on. So I like to show you how to add a new website on your um, existing Google Analytics. Now, so start with home here. Now, when you go down the bottom here, I said add me. So click that, and now on accounts is create a new account. And then just to create a new name. So uh, this is um, uh, for my client. So I just say uh, okay. So I'm going to copy this, and then so account uh, data sharing settings. So I'm going to just check all on uh, as recommended, and then hit the next. And of course, website, and then uh, so let's say uh, iOS apps. So in this case, uh, I just want to measure so the website. It's not apps. So uh, I'm gonna just hit the next here, and then website name. So I'm gonna name the same name, uh, Vania Policy Monitor website, and the website URL. So HTTP. Uh, you have to pick the right one here. So in 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 our case. HTTPS, and I'm gonna just uh, copy their URL and then uh, paste on that. So I'm gonna just uh, get rid of the HTTPS here, and then let's say industry category. So they are non profit. So I'm gonna just keep it as other, and then I'm gonna check with my client later. And then uh, let's set up the camera. Um, we are located in Canada. And time zone is, is Toronto. Okay, and hit the create. And then Google Analytics uh, term and the service agreement. So if you read that through and accept, um, I've done this so many times. I'm gonna just go through and hit accept again, and click accept button. Now it's uh, the redirecting you to uh, the Google Analytics tracking course. Now this code, um, when you build a website, or if you have built the, this website, you have to copy and paste onto your website. So this is basically how you can add a new website onto your existing uh, Google Analytics account. So hope this helps and I'll see you next time.